The dark days of winter are with us, no denying that. But Mike Stevens has a few sparks of light from the PhotoLink Library. A bit of light comes in handy these days, even if it is only a spot of light, as in this Bud Chrysler image from Jessup. A bigger spot would be better, like this one, for example, from Lisa Vital in Hunlock Creek. The reflective white of this perched bald eagle Michael Smith found in Mongop, New York. The slightly muted colors of a visitor Lisa came across in Tunkhannock. But if you really want to brighten things up, you look to the sun. Even reflections of it slipping through the clouds as Debbie Park found are welcome. Louise Stanko of Lansford caught a little of a winter sunset out a window. The view is warmer this way. A sunset after a snowstorm sent in by Carol Kiermar in Benton. A welcome sight indeed. In Brandon Park, Williamsport, Ann Hetzel saw teepees of snow made all the nicer by the faint sun in the sky overhead. And look what the sun brought to Mary Palatko in Freeland. A hint of a rainbow. A nice view anytime, but especially these days. Can't wait till spring, you say? Well, neither can the Dean Sist of Butler Township. The days are getting longer. Long enough to enjoy a view like this one on a walk before supper. Sunset at Laurel Lake and Columbia Crossroads comes from Dale White. Of course, if the sun isn't out and you don't want to wait till morning, you can provide your own sparkling lights as Avis Miller of Berwick did. Whatever you do, don't let the fact that these two saw their shadows get you thinking six more weeks of winter. Mary Gabriel found them in Tunkhannock. Besides, they go a long way toward brightening up the front yard. Mike Stevens here in the PhotoLink Library.